Good morning, Capricorn. How are you guys? How are you guys? It's tea time, babies. I hope you guys woke up blessed. I hope you guys woke up grateful. And I hope you guys woke up motivated and ready to make it do what it do, babies. About to jump right in. Spirit, ancestors, angel guys, you're welcome into the room for a general Capricorn read. To my subscribers, welcome back, babies. To those of you who are new to my channel, hello, I am Lee. I will be bringing you the tea, baby. I keep it real. It might get a little raw and reckless up in here, but my intentions is never to hurt your feelings. So let's go, babies. It's a general read, so everything ain't for everybody. Okay, baby, don't apply pressure. Ego. You got ego. We got boss daddy, ooh, and groupie, ooh, and on the bottom of the deck, we got thief, crying over you, and karmic friends. So what's the tea for our Capricorn? Someone's hurt, baby. Someone been moving from their ego. Uh, someone may be stuck in their ego and is hurting the relationship. For those of you who are in a relationship. Or for those of you who want a relationship. <laughs> we got some boss daddy. Ooh. Stable. Rich. Business owner. CEO. Big dick energy, baby. Capricorn. This can be you though, Capricorn. Okay? It can be she, it can be he. Okay? We're reading energy, baby. But there's a group of people that think that you got big dick energy, baby. <laughs> Ooh, he's sexy too. Um, it makes me feel like, like you're like, um, like you're this boss daddy and someone may not be able to handle the attention that you get. Okay. Someone may be, um, mistaken the attention that you get. And what I mean by that is like, this is just naturally how you move. So the attention may not be flattering to you. Uh, you may be used to the attention. Um, obsessive, obsessive lover. Unhealthy, possessive, karmic, karmic friends, can't fully trust them, tension, secret competition, keep your friends close and your enemies closer, sad, hurt, upset, someone is crying over you, and be careful with a thief, baby, robbed, lost, theft, physical, or emotional. Um... It feels like somebody um, is not comfortable with the attention that you get. Um, big dick energy. I like that. <laughs> I like that. That's the first time that card comes out since I've had the deck. Um... They think you, you that person, you that person, okay? Uh, when you walk into a room, you turn heads, baby, okay? Um, you just give off boss vibes, boss vibes. Let's see what is in your heart space for our Capricorns. What's in your heart space, baby? 
for our Capricorn spirit ancestors, angel guides, clear, concise messages, expression. You are ready to manifest your thoughts and transform them into acts of love. All right. And on the bottom, we have tolerance. You appreciate other points of view because you sense the love in everyone. Okay, so maybe you are flattered. <laughs> Okay, maybe you are flattered by the attention that you get. Um, but maybe you're not realizing that you're hurting somebody's feelings. Okay, or somebody's feelings are getting hurt. Somebody's ego. You're hurting someone's ego. So you may be dealing with someone who had a big ego. And when they met you, they met, they match. Okay, that sounds about right. It sounds like somebody met, they match. And it's not making them happy. Okay, maybe they don't feel like they're good enough for you. Or maybe they just feel like you got too much going on. Moving on into the Naughty Oracle. Uh, enlightenment sucks. Hmm. And become self-aware. So it makes me feel like you're, you not, um, aware of how you're making someone feel. Um, so someone in your energy may be feeling uh, sad, depressed. Um, it's like like it can it can be a work thing too. Okay, it can be a work thing where you uh, someone feels like you sh you still in their their shine. Okay, like, uh, like they could have been the one getting the attention. They could have been the one, um, success. They could have been the one that, um, it's like you took their place. Okay, you may have taken their position. Okay, you may have, there may have been some type of, um, There, it seems like there's a position, and you stole the position, baby. Okay, whether it's in work or love, the fool. Whether it's in work and, or love, someone recognized your efforts and your achievements, and you may have gotten the position, a higher position, uh... It was an opening for a higher position. And it seems like you took the risk. And it may be paying off. Um, it doesn't feel like you try to step on nobody's toes. You just worked hard for it. Okay, baby, the Knight of Pentacles, that's my favorite night. That's also an earth sign. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. So, this, this is naturally. This is who you are naturally. Okay? You're naturally a boss daddy, baby. Or it could be female. It could be male. We're reading energy. But the point is that this is naturally who you are. Okay? You were, you've worked hard on yourself. You've worked hard on building your skills. Uh, maybe your people skills. Uh, your work ethnic, ethics. You. Period. It's just you. You just give big dick energy. <laughs> um, you're successful. Slow and steady. Wins the race. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. And you're being recognized. Okay? You're being recognized. People notice. You walk in the room and they just notice you. Okay, baby? You look like you smell good. 
I love a man that smell good. Sheesh. So we have the Six of Pentacles. Um, the Six of Pentacles is someone who's charitable. Uh, someone who tries to help. Um, then we have the Ten of Swords in the center. Let's keep going. Or you may decide to stop giving. Okay? Because we have the Six of Pentacles, then the Ten of Swords. And death. Yes. Putting an end to a situation. Putting an end to you may have been helping or giving. And someone may have not appreciated it or um, took an advantage of the situation. And you may be deciding or contemplating on putting it to an end. Uh, someone may be... Um, Intimidated by you, how you move. So we have death, we have the Ten of Swords, and we have death. So something needs to come to an end in order for something to bring transformation and change. Um, so that something new can come about. And we have the star. Um, putting something to an end may be able to align you with who or what you want. Um, putting something to an end may bring a realization of what are your deepest dreams and desires. Um, you may have ended something with someone because they was in their ego. Or because they was jealous, over possessive. You may be jealous and over possessive. Um, someone didn't see your worth. A queen of cups. We got a queen of cups. Someone probably was just like emo like an emotional wreck. Okay, someone was an emotional, yep, someone was grieving. Someone was grieving. Ugh. So, so far out here we got Scorpio, Aquarius, the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone may have been grieving the loss, losing you, uh, or someone may have been grieving a loss. Um, you may have not understood where they was coming from, and you may have ended it. Yes. Sorry about that. Uh, let's get one more for our Capricorn Spirit Ancestors Angel Mark. Angel guys, thank you. And we have the high priestess in reverse. Oh, wow. So, uh, <laughs> um, the high priestess is Pisces. So, um, someone may be, um, being led astray. Someone may be being led astray because they're overthinking it, okay? They're overthinking, they're stressed out, um, there was grief, there was a horrible ending, overkill, ten of swords in the center. Um, there may have actually been a death, a transformation. 
But um, everything happens for a reason. Okay, this completion. Um, that you may still be holding on to. Um, not being realistic about. Some kind of outcome that you're not seeing clearly. Okay, some kind of outcome that you're not seeing clearly. Uh, something that you may have wanted to be successful, but ended up having to put an end to the situation. For your own sanity, baby. For your own sanity. Here we go. Moving on, moving on. For our Capricorns, what messages, your ancestors, do we have for our Capricorns today? That's way too many. Clear messages. Clear messages for our Capricorns. What do they need to know? What do they need to hear? What messages do we have for our Capricorns? These cards are brand new, so they be flying. Okay. Judgment. Judgment and the Four of Swords. Yeah, it's time to relax, baby. It's time to relax, baby. Wake up call. So wake up call, judgment. You may be judging someone harshly. They may be judging you harshly. Um, and it may just be time to fall back, baby. To recuperate, baby. Self-love, rejuvenation, protecting yourself. Okay, um... A wake-up call, okay? A wake-up call. Uh, you may have to fall back. You may have already fell, fallen back. Um, Eight of Pentacles decided to continue to work on yourself, to work on your growth, to... Dedicate yourself. Dedicating yourself to make it better. Whatever it is. Okay? You know your life, baby. I don't know your life. Um, dedicating yourself to improving yourself. Okay? Your surroundings. Uh, uh, let's see, let's see. The magician. Okay, so there's something that you may be trying to manifest with this judgment and this magician. Uh, having a wake-up call, a realization of what it is that you really want or you really need in your life. Understanding that you have the willpower to succeed in whatever it is that you put your mind to. Um, you have all the resources and the ability so you may just be trying to concentrate in order to manifest. Right now we got judgment, magician, and the star is what I'm looking at. Um, so you know you're capable, very capable. Very capable. Uh, you may be that boy, that bitch. And... Um, you may be coming into the realization that you can be and do and have whatever it is that you desire. Okay, being bold, courageous. We got the Knight of Wands. So, it looks like someone is going for what they want. Okay, somebody's ready to put in the work. For what they want. Putting your best foot forward Capricorn. It looks like putting your best foot forward. After a realization. After uh, some self love. Maybe some 
some affirmations, you know, telling yourself that you're worth it, telling yourself that you're great, telling yourself that you that boy or you that girl. Um, yep, yeah, we got the King of Wands, baby. King of Wands. Taking on a leadership role in your own life. Seeing the bigger picture. Yeah, there's a wake-up call. It's like, it's, it's a wake-up call. It's seeing the bigger picture, um, self-evaluation, and taking charge, baby. Ooh. I, I, I should have just said it. <laughs> so the first role is in finances, work, okay, a job, where you stand as far as your money is concerned, where you stand as far as your stability, uh, who you are as a person, okay? Um, but uh, with this ego and this groupie car and on the bottom a thief, um, it seems like something or someone or some people got in the way of who or what you really cared about. Um, your person was probably in their ego. Your person was probably hurt some way. Uh, and then there was a wake-up call. And uh, there, there was a need for balance. So it looks like now you're trying to balance between your finances and love. Okay, because we got the two of cups on top of the star. Okay, so. So your wishes, your dreams, aspirations is in love. Okay, so. As far as your money's concerned, you're stable. You boss. You the boss. You the boss of you. Um, you got that part of it down pat. As far as love is concerned, we got the Queen of Cups. We got the King of Cups on top of the Queen of Cups, which is a div a divine partnership, a divine connection. Your person. Your person. Okay, um, but we have two kings out here, baby. We got the king of wands and we got the king of cups. So you have, um, Leo, Sagittarius, Aries, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Feminine and Masculine. A divine connection, baby. Something that makes you feel uh, emotionally fulfilled. Or someone who knows how to love your baby. We have the High Priestess on top of the High Priestess. What in the world? Double confirmation. Double confirmation, baby. So, the high priestess, she knows. She knows way more than she lets off. Okay? So, you may know exactly who it is that you love or you want to be with or you want to grow with or you want to work with or you're moving towards. Okay? Uh, someone who felt maybe left out in the cold. Or someone who made you feel left out in the cold. It wasn't ending. The path was not clear. But it seems like it's, you want to give back. You want, you want to offer this person something or you want to help them in some way. This is somebody that you may be a little obsessed over. Okay, with this devil and this ten of cups and the four of cups, this is someone you may be obsessing over. This is someone who may have denied that it was access denied. Um, access was denied because it was unclear. It was unclear. But it looks like this is faded. 
like in divine timing, the situation will come together. Um, we have another queen out here too. There's a lot of people, like. Uh, I feel the loss. There's some type of loss. So you may have lost this person along the line. This person may have lost you along the line. Uh, you may have been committed somewhere else or they may have been committed somewhere else. Um, but there's endings. There was endings, there was transformations. It was overkill. It was an overkill. So let's see over here. Let's go with the love oracles for our Capricorns. Love oracles, spirit ancestors, angel guides. Capricorn, please subscribe. Please hit that like button. You would like to send me a comment? Thank you. I read those. Let's make it do what it do, babies. I appreciate your views, your love and support to my channel, your donations, your interactions. Thank you, guys. Here we go. Here we go. Lovers oracles for our Capricorns. What do they need to know? What do they need to hear? Break up. Finance. Somebody got ghosted. Walking away, ending, separation, it's right. over. Finances, money problems, work, material things, and success. Okay. So there was a breakup. Uh, finances were, may have been a problem. Or you, because this is Capricorn, and Capricorn works a lot. Okay, Capricorn works a lot. Capricorn is... Um, about they break, okay? So you may have not been giving someone the time, the attention. Uh, someone may have thought that you was giving other people attention. Change, baby. But there's definitely a wake up call, I feel it real strong, okay? Change, regen regeneration, growth, metamorphosis, metamorphosis, and cycles. All right? So you may be working on yourself um, and evaluating yourself to see where you can better yourself. Or what was it? Yeah, somebody got ghosted. It still came out even though I went all the way through the deck. Disappeared, silenced, ignored, and rejected. But then we have divine intervention, baby. Serendipity, baby. Catalyst. Supernatural and karma. Okay, so it may have not worked out when you wanted it to because it wasn't supposed to, it wasn't meant to, it wasn't time. Intuition, gut feeling, psychic, premonition, sixth sense. Follow your intuition, baby. Okay, go within. Go within. See how it feels. What's going on with your baby? Reconciliation. It wasn't the right time. Reunion. Second chance. Back together. I miss you. It wasn't the right time and someone really felt like you had other things going on. You was getting attention from everybody else. Uh, you was too busy. Um, you didn't have time. You didn't let them in. You didn't give them a fair chance. They feel like you didn't give them a fair chance. So you hurt their ego, baby. You hurt their ego, baby. Mm. Can we get one more for our Capricorns? Can we get one more for our Capricorns? Party. Celebrate, event, public, social gathering, 
On the bottom, we have storm warning, upheaval, upheaval, obstacle, wrecking ball, drama, fear, afraid, uneasy, suspicion, and scared. Roll the dice, baby. Take a chance, risk, leap of faith, strategy, heartbreak, snake, relationship. All right. So. That just made me feel like there's going to be some drama. Okay, like there's going to be some job, some drama. Like you're going to reconciliate with someone. And something is going to happen. Or somebody's going to find out. Or some, like you may run into someone or whatever. And there's going to be drama. Here we go. Moving on to the Romance Angels for our Capricorns. Somebody ain't, ain't going to be happy about the situation. We got Rob lost, that physical or emotional. Okay. Uh, somebody may be like, just like cock blocking, like, um, like, like in the way, in the way of your joy. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. Uh, somebody stressed out. Somebody be up in their head about it. Okay. It can be that queen of pentacles. Okay, Queen of Pentacles is um, feminine, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. Okay. Uh, it doesn't have to be, so don't get fixated on the signs. But that's what I'm looking at, so that's where we're going with it. Here we go, here we go. Messages for our Capricorns, Spirit Ancestors, Angel Guys, from the Romance Angels for our Capricorns. You deserve love, baby. You are lovable. Flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. On the bottom, you have free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Okay, because it feels like there's somebody lingering in your energy that tries to manipulate how you go about things. Or who you deal with. Or how you deal. Um, somebody's like be in the way. Like a lot in the way. And we did have a lot of people. So it can be you. It can be them. Like this energy can be in your energy. It can be in their energy. Type of situation. So let's go in the dark. For our Capricorns, let's see, let's see. What's the hidden intention for our Capricorns? Let's go behind the scenes, baby. Let's go behind the scenes. Here we go. For our Capricorns, Spirit Ancestors, Angel Guides, clear, concise messages for Capricorn. Uh, let's see, baby. The Grim Reaper, baby. And came, the Ten of Swords came out. Death came out. And now the Grim Reaper came out. The relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. Okay. Don't get stuck in the back and forth. Okay. Don't get stuck in the... Um, uh, and the obsession, because there was obsession, and it's either you being obsessive over the this person, or this person being obsessive over you and not letting you move and not letting you grow. It's like this person stunts your growth when it comes to your love life. Sunglasses, watching, looking, stalking, gaslighting, perception, focusing out. Okay. Um, they could be watching, they could be watching, somebody watching you, baby. Somebody stalks you, baby. Okay. Mirror, mirroring each other. Self-image, relationships, reflects our wounds, introspective. Can we get three more for our Capricorns? Keys on a ring. Many options, yep, yep, 
Yep. Many options. Like you walk into the room and you spin heads. Like, oh, here come boss daddy. <laughs> Uh, many options, decisions, unconventional, string along, and one night stand. Be careful with them one night stands, baby. Okay, because they may um uh devalue your worth. Healing heart, healing from heartbreak, freedom from toxic relationship or addiction. Yep, 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 yep. There's a lot of ending, letting go, transformation, going for what you really want. Um, something that stresses you out. Person, place, or thing. Not today, babe. Not today. Not dealing, hurt, avoiding a conversation, call person, boundaries, still angry. So, feeling stabbed in the back, heartbroken, pain, separation, deception. Shocking attack, boat, receiving what you need, progressing, arriving, moving on, closure issues, photograph, looking at your photos, missing you, nostalgia, and wants to make new memories, heart with the key, welcoming love, meeting the one, open your heart, getting together, perfect. All right, baby, so when you decide to close things out, people, places, and things. Uh, you will be opening yourself up to what it is for you. Maybe to be able to go for what you really want in your life or who you really want in your life uh, without interference. Okay, babies, without interference. So let me give you some affirmations. Then we'll ask your question. Oh, as a matter of fact, we'll do a, a message from every from each sign for our Capricorns. Affirmations for Capricorns to take along the way in their soul's journey. A little advice for our Capricorn to take along the way in their soul's journey. Please hit that like button, Capricorn. Please subscribe. Don't be shy, baby. It's free, baby. Thank you. I appreciate you guys. Uh, start. Start each day with a grateful heart. Yes. Be grateful. Be grateful that you woke up today, baby. Okay? Be grateful for the little things. See the little things, baby. Okay? See the little things. Do what you love and love what you do. One more for our Capricorns. We got two. Find yourself and be that. And we have, you have to start to be great. Believe you can do it, baby. Believe you can do it, baby. Have faith in yourself. Move with integrity. Forward and up. Okay, release what needs to be released and whatever needs to be ended. Um, see people, places, and things for who they really are. And don't be afraid to move forward. Answering questions, answer. Yeah. Okay, so I just got tongue twisted. Someone may be tongue twisted. Someone may be confused. Okay, babies? So I'm going to give you a moment to ask your questions to your angels. All right. You ready? You ready? Answering questions for our Capricorns. Answering questions for our Capricorns. Hold on. Oh. My legs crossed too long. Answering questions for our Capricorns. Almost. Not quite. Here we go. Don't stop. Don't stop. Keep on moving. Don't stop, baby. Keep on moving. Don't stop. 
abundance. One more for our Capricorns. Angel guides, one more for our Capricorns. Thank you. Peaceful resolution, baby. And on the bottom of the deck, you got no. It's a no, cat. It's a no. In the new in the near future, romance. It's a no, baby. So here we go. Get one message from each sign. Starting with the water signs. Starting with Pisces. For our Capricorns. Messages from Pisces. For Capricorn. Spirit Ancestors Angel Guides. Clear, concise messages. What do they feel? If we can if they can tell you anything, baby. Let's see, let's see. What do they feel? Pisces for Capricorn. Here we go. Pisces for Capricorn. That's a lot. Oh, my goodness. I'm going to just read them to you, baby. I wish it was less complicated. Uh, I may be running, but my soul wants you only. I don't know how to talk to you. And your eyes are enchanting. Pisces thinks you're enchanting, baby. Uh, Cancer for Capricorn. Cancer for Capricorn. Messages for Capricorn. From Cancer. I know you're the one for me. Ooh. Um, Scorpio for Capricorn. Scorpio for Capricorn. You got to say, Scorpio. I've been lying to myself for so long. Okay, moving on. Air signs. Gemini for Capricorn. Gemini. I need some alone time now. And I'm sorry I lied to you. Virgo, I mean, Gemini, Libra, for Capricorn, Libra for Capricorn, what messages, clear, concise message do we have, I want to message you, but I'm scared you might reject me. We had Gemini, Libra, Aquarius for Capricorn. I love you more than I will ever let on. Okay. Uh, Earth sign. Capricorn for Capricorn. I don't feel I deserve you. Virgo for Capricorn. Virgo, I hope you can forgive me. Um, Taurus for Capricorn. Taurus, messages from Taurus. I can feel that magnetic towards you and then we have fire Sagittarius for Capricorn Sagittarius for Capricorn messages you're the best that's ever happened to me uh, Leo for Capricorn Leo for Capricorn. That's way too many. Leo for Capricorn. Clear messages from Leo. 
Thank you. Uh, I want you to love me for who I am. And Aries. Aries for Capricorn. Message. You are my missing piece. And the overall energy on the bottom of the deck, baby, is I'm still learning how to love myself. Okay, cat. Those were your messages from the Zodiac. Give you some fortune cookies to take along the way in your soul's journey, baby. Here we go. Message, uh, fortune cookie for our Capricorn. Let's see what you got. Love, ooh, love is in the air. A great time for commitment and taking relationships to the next level. Uh, opportunities. A stranger is about to change your life, baby. Exciting times and plenty of action, plus a special family reunion looks likely. That's probably that party. So you may run into somebody at that party or at a party or some type of something. Okay, something. Can we get one more for our Capricorns? It didn't flip. I'm not taking it. Here we go. Change, baby. A change of residence, partner, career, or job is on the cards. You're restless and in need of change, and that is exactly what is coming your way. On the bottom, you have major life change. Time is right for major life changes as a new lifestyle or location. Brings great joy and a trouble-free existence. Okay, babies. And that was your tea, baby. Smooches.